I've seen you on uh, YouTube. Oh yeah. You got it. Yeah, that's me. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? Good. How are you doing? Hey, Cincinnati Picker. Yeah, you watch the channel? Yeah, buddy. I'm John. What's your name? Eve. Eve, it's nice to meet you. I do. I'm more metal detecting. I'm pissed oh, off. Yeah? But yeah, um, used to do the flipping stuff all the time. You set up here a lot? No, first time actually yeah. here. I come all the time. Yeah. <laughs> it's my uh, secret honey hole, but yeah. <laughs> do you sell on eBay too? Used to. Yeah. yeah. I was gonna say this one will probably have some pretty good value, I would think. I actually used that. That was Did you? fine. I bought it new and uh you can't really use it um for I'm old, so you can't use it for wreck you can't use it for wreck softball. Because it's Cause too it's light. Yeah. yeah. And it's what is it like minus it's gonna be minus six, I think, something like that. Mm -hmm. Or thirty four inches or whatever. But it's a wonderful bat. I love it. Yeah, seriously, Mike it makes good ones. Thank you. Thank you. What do you got on it? I'd probably do 10. Sure, I'm not going to argue with you. All right. I appreciate it. Yeah, I used to watch you guys when I was listening and posting. No kidding. <laughs> and That's I was so like, funny. heck yeah, I haven't bumped into them. Because I go to, you know, I used to go to estate sales and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Thanks a lot, buddy. Yeah, you thank you. Day. You too. Good nice luck to you. you. Nice meeting you too. What do you got on your starter? Five bucks. I've had it in a storage unit. I've never ever used it. I'll take it. How about your trophies? <laughs> Couple bucks a piece. Sure. I'm up to nine. I'll just fill my bag and settle up with you at the end. Oh great, you got the perfect change too. Thank you, sir. Have a good one. You too. You have a floater, you just got a hat. I'll take your buck here. You got any other sporting good stuff? No. There you go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. It does work. I do 10 bucks. All it. right. Thank you. If the antenna on that boom box wasn't broken, I would have bought it. Um, in good condition, it was selling for about 30 or 40 bucks. But some of those boom boxes can bring some really good money. So keep an eye out for them. What you got on your uh, five a piece? Happy meal. Did you take ten for three of them? Sure. Okay. I've seen you on uh, YouTube. Oh yeah. You got it. Yeah, that's me. Get on this hundred dollar rock. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Yeah, that's what I, I, I'm doing this stuff full time now. I retired, retired two months ago. I've done this my whole life. Now, now I can uh, 
do, do it full time. Yep. I appreciate the deal. I never used to come up here because I had to work every one of I just started coming up here. Yeah, I, I just I retired. I've been retired a little over a year. Yeah, well, well, yeah. Look, look me up. I, I, I get a lot of different. I go to auctions and yard sales and stuff. And I like your yearbook. Would you go twenty on it? I can do that. All right. Man, yeah, I appreciate that's it. That's in good shape. A lot of people don't know what these are. I, I pick yeah. them up pretty reasonable all yeah. the time because the ones with Kofax and Oh, I found Oscar the one with Kofax. Yep. Yeah. It was like 54, 55, yeah, something like that. Yeah. He was only there a year. Yeah. Hey, good luck to you, man. All right. Thank you. All right. I got three dollars. My dad put Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's just 15, but I'll take five. Thank you so much. The posters are five, but okay. they're not 10 anymore. Okay. So I had them to 127 sell, and the, the longer I have stuff, the lower the price it gets. All the things last here is five bucks. If you buy every bit of it, that'll give you a really good deal if you want it all. What's your cards? It's 20. 20 bucks? Yeah. If I get that for 20, would you throw in a poster? Sure. All right, you got a deal. <laughs> it Don Mattingly. Yeah, most of them are moves. I, the ones I keep at home are, uh, are um, well, rock posters. Oh, yeah? Like Hendrix and Jimmy Page. Oh, yeah, those are cool. I just sold Hendrix, Jimmy Page today, and uh, Jimmy Page was just tall. No kidding. Yeah, I sold that, and I had Jim Hendrix and Randy Rhodes and all, all Holy the cow. All together. What are you got on your camera, sir? Um, oh, what's your, how much is your camera, ma'am? Oh, five dollars. Five bucks? I got everything in there. Got the box and everything. I'll give you five bucks for it. There you go. Thank you, ma'am. What's up, guys? This morning, I went to the flea market in Brookville, Indiana, and I like going to this one because it's on Wednesday mornings, and it's pretty rare to have a Wednesday flea market, but it's nice to just Kind of break up the week, go find some stuff. And I did find some pretty good stuff. Got it all pulled out, I'm gonna show you what I bought. I got this remote starter, new in the packaging for $5. It's a little dusty, just because it was sitting in storage for so long, so I gotta clean it up a little bit, but it is selling for around 35 to 40 bucks plus shipping. I got this Mikan Halo Light Fast Pitch Bat for $10. It was actually a viewer of the channel I ran into. I have no idea what this thing is worth, unfortunately. I couldn't find any kind of comps, but Mikan's a really good brand, so it's probably worth more than 10 bucks. I'll have to do some more research and get it listed. And if you guys heard her mention, she has a TikTok about um, metal detecting, kayaking, a lot of outdoor stuff. So if you guys wanna check that out, I'll put a link down below in the description. Got this really cool Don Mattingly poster, new in the plastic. Unfortunately, it's got a little bit of a tear right there. It's got some damage. It is from the Costacos Brothers. Costacos Brothers. A lot of those uh, vintage sports posters can do really good. I paid five for this one and looks like it's selling for about 25, 30 bucks. Got some Michael Jordan McDonald's stuff. I just thought these are really cool. Fitness Fun Challenge. There's a Frisbee. A little like stopwatch thing and a basketball. I paid 10 bucks for the three. I'm just going to sell these on whatnot as part of one of my basketball auctions. I doubt they'll bring a lot of money, but it'll just be a fun kind of change of pace for running some cards and uh, memorabilia. Same with this thing. Baseball stars of 1955 Yogi Bear and Willie Mays on the cover for two bucks. Book's not in great shape, but just it'll be a fun thing to uh, run in one of my whatnot auctions. This is a really special piece right here. This is a 1960 University of Cincinnati yearbook, and it has Oscar Robertson in it. So if we flip back here, I've got him uh, bookmarked. There he is right there. He's on like seven or eight of these pages. There he is again. There he is. I paid 20 for this. I think it's worth 75 to 100. I might just keep it in my private collection for a while. I don't know. I'll put listed for a high price and just... Keep it in my collection and uh, just kind of enjoy it till it sells. I got two trophies for five bucks. These are from the 80s. It is a Fraternal Order of Police. It's not too often I see police trophies. And believe it or not, some old trophies can have some value. Unfortunately, these are plastic toppers. I wish they were metal toppers. That could definitely make a difference. A lot of people like to craft with these things. They'll make wine toppers or different things. I'm not sure what I'll get for these, to be perfectly honest. I might just take the tops off and and sell the pair, try to get like 
20 25 bucks for the pair of toppers but keep an eye out for old trophies guys especially the ones like 70s and earlier with the metal toppers if they're unique different something like that they can bring some decent money got a 1995 baseball uh, series one and two complete set sealed in the plastic i paid 20 for this and i actually got him to throw in the poster so I've either got 15 into this and five under the poster or $20 and that was free either way. This is selling for about 50 bucks. Last thing I picked up is this Kodak Easy Share V610. Didn't even look it up when I found it. The price was right. Got it for five bucks and it is worth about 30. That is it for this video guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.